Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome into ForTheLoad.net, the best place on the planet to buy vintage electronics, especially ones similar to this one. And today, what I have here is a Sony 5-disc CD player and changer system. The model number is CDP-C445. It's got a bunch of really neat features. It's got custom file. It has an optical digital audio output, which is something that many people look for. It provides superior audio, but let's go ahead and talk about it. So on the rear panel of it, you have your line output right here for analog audio. And then you have your digital optical audio right here. And this was manufactured in January of 1995 and it was manufactured in Japan. Connecting it is very easy. All you have to do is plug in your red and white cable or your optical cable and then connect the other end of the cable to a audio system of some kind or a speaker. It will connect to just about any speaker. And then once you have it all wired up, you can go ahead and power it on and insert your CDs. I already put some CDs in there. And this is the original remote control for it. It's got just about all the same functions that are on the front panel. One of the neat functions that it has is music scan. If you push the music scan button, while your discs are playing and you have it set to one disc. So we'll put it on one disc and, and then when we push music scan, what it will do is it will play the first 10 seconds of every track on the disc so that you know what tracks are on the disc if you want to play a certain track. Dirty pop. And then if you have it set to all discs, it will do the same thing, but for each disc, and it will only do one track or the first track on each disc. And then you've also got shuffle play with shuffle play. What that does is it will randomly select a disc and then randomly select a track from that disc. Or if you have it set to one disc, it will randomly select a track from that disc until it plays every disc, every track on that disc. But you can also set it to continuous play or repeat play if you want it to play nonstop. And then on the front panel of it, you have your power button. And then you have continue, shuffle, and program play. With program play, you can queue up some songs if you want. But I'll show you the shuffle really quick. So we'll set it to shuffle. And then we'll do all discs shuffle. And we'll push play. So first it's going to randomly select a disc. And then once it picks a disc, it will randomly select a track from that disc. She keeps them up. And then if you push skip, it will skip to a randomly selected track once again. And then... If you have repeat turned on, it says it right there, it will continuously play, of course. And then right here you have your disc select buttons, discs one through five. And then over here you have your play functions. You've got skip forward, skip backwards, search forward and backwards, play, pause, and stop. And then right here you have disc skip, open, close, and exchange. And if you have a disc playing and you push the exchange button, what it will do is it will continuously play that disc while you exchange for other ones. And then over here, you have your phone's level adjustment, which that goes with this phone's output right here. If you wanna listen with some headphones, you can do that instead of using the speaker system. And then down here, you have your custom file options. With those, you can make it so that it will completely skip certain tracks on certain disks if you want to do that. 
And then right here you have music scan, peak search, that will look for the highest point in a song. And then you have time, you can adjust how the time is displayed right there. And then you have fader with fader, it will fade out the music and then it will stop it. And then right here you have a number pad, numbers one through 10 for jumping to a certain track. And then over here you have edit slash time fade, check, and then plus 10, and then clear. And a couple other things that are really nice about this is it will have a really big display right here so you can easily see the track number and disc number from a distance. And then it also plays recordable discs as well if you wanna listen to those on here. And then down here it says it has a high density linear converter and then it has the optical digital output of course and digital spindle servo system. All right, so that's pretty much all there is for this Sony five disc CD player. It's got some neat features. It's got really nice audio too. It makes it convenient to listen to five discs if you want. But if you want to order one, make sure you get it at ForTheLow.net for the best quality and the best price. And you can order over the phone if you want, or you can get it on our online store.